Good morning, Ramblin' Pam here, coming to you from a very wet and rainy morning this morning. A while back we were in West Yellowstone and we came across this very unique museum. It's inside the Branch Restaurant, located just a couple of blocks from the west entrance to Yellowstone National Park. Let's go take a look inside. This is a fully restored Oregon Shortline train car, car number 1903. The exterior of the Oregon Shortline cars were painted in a Van Dyke brown color. The charm of the wooden exterior and interior construction was typical of that period. According to the information posted online, car number 1903 rode the rails carrying its dignitaries with grace and elegance. The Oregon Shortline was organized in 1881 as a subsidiary of the Union Pacific. The Union Pacific intended the line to be the shortest route from Wyoming to Oregon. In the early 1900s, the railroad started to advertise tours of Yellowstone National Park. They constructed a spur from Idaho Falls, Idaho to West Yellowstone, Montana. In 1938, Union Pacific started consolidating operations and leased a number of its subsidiaries, including the Oregon Short Line. The railroad operated under the lease until December 30, 1987, when the Oregon Short Line was fully merged into the Union Pacific Railroad. Since its days as an executive car, it served as a summer retreat for various owners. In 1935, the car was given as a retirement gift to E.C. Mason. Can you believe getting a retirement gift like that? That would be so cool. He sat it on a stone foundation next to the forest, just three blocks west of here. After a number of owners used it as a summer home, Clyde and Linda Seeley purchased it in 1975 and lived there during that summer. It had been painted over many, many times with various colors. By this time, it had lost its identity and looked just like an old relic. But on the inside, it still had maintained its immaculate condition. It must have been pretty exciting when photos of it were found at the Smithsonian Institute and its real identity was discovered. One photo showed the completed car in front of a Pullman factory, the other an interior shot with the original furniture. In 1995, the car was moved here and restoration began. This Oregon Shortline car became a museum in honor of the railroad and its influence on West Yellowstone. Oh my gosh, the geese are coming. <laughs> so much for that shot. <laughs> This is the dining room, it's so gorgeous and elegant. You can see attention was paid to every detail. The craftsmanship and the wood use was beautiful. This is one of the bedrooms. I'm sure they made it really comfortable to sleep in these, especially for the time. This was back in the early 1900s. And we've got geese again. <laughs> It's free to tour this museum, but you might want to check to make sure it's open right now because I think it doesn't open until maybe the 15th of December um, because of COVID. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye.